We are here to present a list of grievances. Grievances? Yes. We've been elected by the workers to ask for redress. Our wages have been cut 35% in the past year. We're in a recession. Orders are down. We all must make sacrifices. Management suffers no pay cuts. And lose them to the competition. What about the rents? What do rents have to do with wages? Everything. Many of your workers have become debtors just to pay them. Your profits come at our expense. It's my money, damn it! I own this factory! Now get out of my office! Honey, pick up your feet when you walk. I am picking up my feet, Helen. What I mean is pick them up and move them forward. What does it look like I'm doing, Helen? <laughs> it looks like you're shuffling in place. Hmm, interesting. Yet somehow, I'm managing to keep up with you. Well, at this pace, we're going to be late for the appointment. <sighs> you know, it's time you... Helen, I do not need a wheelchair. Not a wheelchair. Or a hover-out. What I need is for you to stop watching me as if I'm some criminal trying to escape. <laughs> That's what's slowing me down. If I thought they were going to give the money to his wife, I'd fucking pay. I know how they fucking operate. They're going to take the 20 grand, which as long as we're on the topic, ain't fucking owed to them. Tony? It was a personal loan from him to me. And tell me I'm wrong, Butch. The minute, the fucking minute he died, the first thing the old man and Jackie and all the rest of them talked about was how much they could use the money he had on the street. Tony ain't got a fucking thing to do with it. It's bullshit, Butchie. 20 years ago, I would have paid no questions asked. Ah, fuck him. And fuck you too, Butchie, for doing their legwork. I mean, you're a solid guy and everything, but Jesus fucking Christ, Butch. Get the fuck out of here. Connections is what gets you jobs. Why do I need you? I know people who do places like this. I can just do jobs with them. Yeah, well, whoever you know isn't very good, or else you wouldn't know them. Stay away from amateurs. They won't get you anywhere. Now, unlike office boy Jim, there isn't exactly a mailroom position for people of our professional nature. You've got to know people who are in, who can vouch for you. Just better get my name out. Hey, just keep a cool head, and don't forget to say thank you. It's polite. Jeez, you're so uptight. What's on your mind, boy? It's your turn, old man. You don't have all day. Now that wasn't very nice. You love your grandpa, don't you? Whose turn is it? Why did you hurt me so much? What do you mean? Any punishment for me was well deserved. And you'll get everything you deserve. It's eight. I'm sorry. The square, it's eight. Oh, oh, the puzzle. Yes, thank you. You don't believe me, do you? Oh no, it's not that. I just... But don't you trust me? It's eight, I swear. I don't know what's wrong with me. But I've already wrote this damn script once. You don't expect me to produce this, do you? Someone left this at the front desk for you? Just leave it right there. Uh-huh. Yeah. 